Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's go over how to apply the power of power property with a monomial. Okay, it states this, x to the a, then raised to the b equals x, and you have a times b. So let's apply that. So we have this monomial, okay? So we have 6a to the 8, b to the 7, and it's going to be raised to the cube. So let's get to work. We have negative 6, and that's to the first power, times 3. And then we have a, 8 times 3, because it's raised to the 8th power, and then b, and that's 7 times 3. When you multiply this, we have negative 6 to the 3rd. a to the 8 times 3 is 24, and b, 7 times 3 is 21. Now what we need to do is this negative 6, you know, is negative 6 times negative 6 times negative 6. And that equals a negative 2, 16. And then we have a to the 24th. Whoops. That's a 24. B to the 21st. Okay. So that's the first one um, when you're applying the power of power property. Let's look at another example. Okay, I picked this one because you have lots of signs all over the place, and so let's get to work. Okay, so first we have uh, 3 to the first times negative 2, and then we have a, and that's 5 times negative 2, and then we have h, and that's a negative 6 times a negative 2. Okay, so let's see what that gives us. So now we have 3 to the negative 2, a 5 times negative 2, remember a positive and a negative is a negative, so that would be negative 10, and then the h, we have a negative and a negative, that's going to be positive, and 6 times 2 is 12. Now what we need to do, we need to write it to where we do not have any negative exponents. So to do that, we just place it over 1, okay, and then that's, 1 over a to the 10th, and then h will be on top. And so one more thing that will become 9, 1 ninth, because 3 squared is 9, and then we have a 1, a over 10, and then the, uh, let's write it like this so you know what is going on. The h will be on top, barely made it. I hope that was helpful. Thanks for watching. And remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.